Welcome back everybody. Good Thursday evening to you all a smoky day out there and uh, the air quality is not as good as it was uh, just 24 hours ago. Another warm one current temperature of 75 degrees and uh, the wind was calm and the temperatures were a little cool earlier on and then once that wind picked up kind of scoured out the minor inversion uh, that we had and uh, the temperatures were able to warm. Uh, looking from geyser at the high woods and uh, yeah some clouds some haze. Most of this wildfire smoke coming from California room temperature outside southwest wind about 13 miles per hour air quality. Yeah, not as good as it's been. Look how many locations looking at moderate air quality and still around the East Glacier area cup bank uh, unhealthy for sensitive groups. A little more higher concentration of smoke up there off of the Rocky Mountain front and everybody in the 60s and 70s right now. A couple locations once again hit 80 degrees for the third day in a row. Unusually warm uh, here for October. The wind not as bad as it was a little earlier on here, but uh, still under a red flag warning for the rest of this evening for dangerous fire weather conditions. And uh, the latest on that uh, Yogo fire yesterday, not that bad of a, a day as far as the weather conditions. Uh, two days ago it was really bad. Today, pretty uh, tough conditions and uh, there was a good smoke plume coming off of the area here. Here, but uh, still about 3,800 acres have burned 0% containment. It will snow on this fire coming up here this weekend. A lot of little belts uh, seeing some snow showers at the very least uh, Saturday night into Sunday. Uh, it's not rain. It's a hurricane moving towards the Gulf Coast here. This is Delta. 115 mile per hour winds, so it is a major hurricane here, and uh, that will likely make landfall into Louisiana. They've had their fair share of uh, hurricane activity already this year, and uh, another one moving into an area that's already been hit a few times. Uh, back here across the west, the smoke moved in, the smoke moves out a little bit here tomorrow, but then it moves back in on Saturday. This is what keeps me in a job. Southwest winds increasing, and that will pull up more wildfire smoke from California. Saturday ahead of a cold front. Watch what happens when the front goes through a lot of that smoke. Most of the smoke moves out of all of the West here as we go into the weekend. Now the California wildfires likely not seeing significant precipitation, so they still will be emitting some of that smoke. But uh, many of the fires in Montana, Idaho and Oregon will receive a wedding rain and also some flakes of snow. Great air quality Sunday, Monday and Tuesday, but it does come with some other weather weather variables that we'll get to right now. Uh, so for tomorrow, pretty nice day, not as windy. Heading into Saturday, it starts off OK. It will be warm to start off the weekend into Saturday afternoon. But here comes the front by late Saturday afternoon, Saturday evening coming over the Continental Divide with some rain showers. So chance of uh, precipitation increasing later in the afternoon, the evening overnight, Saturday night into Sunday morning, rain showers and some higher elevation snow. And Sunday is not a very pleasant day to be outside. Cooler, windy, there will be some sun. However, uh, we will have some mixed rain and snow showers. And look at this on Monday, a chilly system moving in with some rain, maybe mixed with snow down in the lower elevations. The mountains will see more snow and more wet weather coming through Tuesday night into Wednesday with cooler temperatures. Here's the forecast for tomorrow. Not as windy, fire danger not as bad. Temperatures a little cooler into the 60s and the 70s. Saturday warm out ahead of the front, 70s and 80s. That front goes through in the afternoon with some showers, maybe even a rumble of thunder. Showers and some flakes of snow Saturday night into Sunday morning. Sunday a much cooler day. Highs in the 40s and the 50s in the lower elevations. Full on wintry conditions into the mountains as far as temperature, wind and snow and then into Monday. Here's this little system highs only in the 40s in Helena and Great Falls that could support a little mix of some rain and snow in the lower elevation. Certainly snow down to about 5000 feet on Monday and we've got uh, colder air coming in Wednesday and Thursday with a few more snow showers and for Great Falls still a little on the breezy side tomorrow 75 windy on Saturday showers move in late much cooler on Sunday and a little mix of some rain maybe some wet snowflakes Monday.